Hello guys, if your computer is very badly infected by Trojan, keyloggers, malware, adware, spyware, any kind of viruses, we will be able to remove it today. And even if you are not tech savvy, you will be able to do it. Make sure you do not skip the video and watch the whole video. So let's get started. So the very first thing, we need to do a right click on the start icon and then look for the run window. Now here we need to delete the traces of their viruses first. So we will be moving step by step. So here type P-R-E-F-E-T-C-H. So once you do that, you just have to click on OK. Now here you will find a lot of trash, a lot of junk there and the viruses traces could be here. So we need to wipe it out completely. So select any of the file, press Control A, and then press Shift and Delete. Now when we press Shift and Delete from the keyboard, we are permanently deleting all these bugs and infections. So once it is done, we will move to the next step, and which is, again, open the Run window by doing a right click and click on Run. And this time, we will type Temp, and hit enter. Select any, any of the folder, press Control A, and then Shift Delete. So we are get reading of all the junks with infections. So the last step will be very important. Please make sure you do not skip it. Once this is done, we need to close this. And if some of the files are not getting deleted, it is absolutely fine. You don't need to worry about it. All right, so we have deleted the temp. We will open up the run window again. Either you can simply type run here and I'll just open it. This time we will type percentage temp percentage. And if you have not subscribed to the channel, please go ahead and hit the like button and subscribe for this video. So just press hit enter. And here you will find a lot of files which is which has alphanumeric. So these are all encrypted things. So it could be with the good ones and the bad ones. We don't require any, any of these temporary files. Just select any of them, press Control A, and then Shift Delete. All right. So once you press, it will ask you to click on Continue. So I had 800 megabytes of infections and junk, which I have just deleted. Once this is done, browsers are also infected. So I'll be setting up two um, browsers as well. So most users use Google Chrome and Microsoft Edge. So let's open Google Chrome. Let's disinfect it. So I'm just opening the Google Chrome. So once the Google Chrome is opened, we need to click on these three dots and then go to settings. And here we need to scroll down and look for advanced. And here you will find reset and cleanup. So click on restore settings to original defaults. So this will reset the browser. All of your favorites and bookmarks will be there. So please don't worry about it. Once this is done, we will move to the edge. So I'm opening the edge now. I hope you have already clicked on like and subscribe. I need your support. So let's open Microsoft Edge. So I just have opened it. Here again, we need to click on these three dots and then go to settings. Now here, once you go to the settings, it's very easy to find this reset settings at the very bottom. So you just need to click on that and click on this arrow key and then reset it. So what we have done so far, we have removed all the traces, junks, temps, caches, and restored those uh, browsers, two browsers, Google Chrome and Microsoft Edge. Now what we need to do is, we need to open any of the browser. And here, we need to type Hitman Pro Malware Removal Tool. Now, once you type Hitman Pro Malware Removal Tool, 
a result will come hitmanpro.com so we are going to install a free software and firstly you will download this this uh, application this hitman pro and you will scan it once this is it is done you just need to restart the computer and then you need to uninstall the hitman pro simply type here add or remove now from here you can remove the antivirus program if you want to keep it and if you want to buy it that's absolutely fine it's up to you so I'm just giving you a free solution that's why I asked you to remove it if, if you want to keep this to keep your system protected you, you can definitely do that all right so if it has worked for you please hit the like button and subscribe okay this have a wonderful day bye